everyone. Hope you're having a great day. Odie Matthews here, back on this channel we like to call www. This is going to be a quickie, but not like that, you curve. Dot com slash youtube.edu. And today I'm going to do something I don't normally do um, part unboxing, part review of these t shirts from my lovely friends over at Seedon Trail Goods. They were nice enough to send me over some samples of the new shirts coming to Kickstarter soon. So I uh, thought we'd do an unboxing and check them out. Let's get into it. All right, let's get into this. And we're going to do an unboxing first. So the first thing. I love about this is everything on their packaging is 100% eco-friendly and biodegradable. So I went ahead and just pre-opened this. We're gonna slide this out. Here are the t-shirts, as you can see. Now this plastic bag is 100% water soluble, biodegradable, um, 70, degree, 70 degrees Fahrenheit, I believe. This bag will dissolve. We're gonna test that and try it out but here are some of their new shirts now i'm just going to do my first impression on these something i don't typically do when i get a bag or a product but we're going to start doing a little bit more just so we can have a little bit of a better understanding of what things are like when we first get them okay so we got three t-shirts okay so i'm not 100 percent sure which shirt is which i will find out when i actually do the full review this is the daymaker I think one of these is like an active shirt and one of these is supposed to be more of a regular everyday shirt. Now, just first impression before I wash these, these materials, I'm already loving the way they feel. I'm not good at unboxing, so I don't know what else to say. This is just what they look like coming straight out of the package. Seeding, eco-friendly. Uh, they're just freaking awesome, man. I, I, I love these guys' first Kickstarter that I backed and got t-shirts. They were nice enough to hit me up and be like, hey, do you want to try some of our samples, like I said in the beginning. So these are just what they look like straight off, out of the bag, biodegradable, super comfy. So yeah, that's that's that. Okay, so what I've done here is uh, pick up the camera and um, try to, I don't know how my lighting looks, but basically, I'm gonna test these out for a few days. I'm gonna wash them, try them, take some footage of them, in them, stuff like that. And then I'll come back and do a full review with the shirts how we normally do. So for you, it'll be as quick as like a cut in this video. For me, it's gonna be a couple days. So with that, I'll see you soon. Okay, so Seedon, my good friend Carson over at Seedon, they sent me over, I was back around their last kickstay and some Kickstain Kickstarter, some great t-shirts uh, that came out. I use them all the time and they sent me some samples of their new ones, three different types of shirts to, to fit your different lifestyle needs. You've got the active tee, which I'm currently wearing because I uh, just went on a hike, so I stink. Thank goodness you can't smell through YouTube, but this is like their active tee for sweat. You've got like their everyday tee, which is more of like a cotton type feel. And then you've got their traveler shirt, which is more of like for your longer trips, more versatile type t-shirt. This one feels insanely good. So I just wanted to talk to you about these real quick. Um, look, Satan does some incredible things. They are so pro-environment and so aware of the things that they're doing when it comes to the output and the input and the way they create and the materials that they use that all of these are environmentally friendly, biodegradable materials, just like the whole nine yards. And you can see I'm smiling because that stuff is awesome. Seedon cares a lot about the shirts they make and it was very clear in their last Kickstarter which is why I've been a fan and a supporter and in contact with them to hopefully get my hands on these because these shirts feel unlike anything I've ever really worn and I know I can't really show you like there's no pockets there's no handles to show you so this is just like a hey check these out type video but what I want to say is that this is more like your arc um like your arc knit type you know uh under armor type material but it's lighter it dries quicker when i sweat in it it goes away pretty quick i've worn uh this shirt whoa what was that that was a really bad transition uh this is their daymaker cotton this is um i wear this around the house um i've worn this in a video already uh i love the way this thing feels it's like your typical cotton shirt but lighter more breathable and honestly Feeling, feeling pretty good about this one. Then you have this one. Wow, what? Oh, I'm in this shirt now. Um, this one's my favorite. Uh, look, this is like just a blend of these two together. 
and it's just comfortable, man. Like it is just a comfortable t-shirt. I love this thing. Again, I don't know how to talk about t-shirts. There's not a lot to talk about, but I'm gonna show you some different places that you can wear these shirts. And then this goes away in warm water and we're gonna try that out. So here we go. You can wear them at your desk. You can wear them in the shower. You can wear them in the kitchen. You can wear them on the couch. Thanks, buddy. So now I'm in my kitchen, and if you boil this bag, it apparently dissolves. So I got a pot, got a stove, got the bag, boil some water, see what happens. Okay, so the water's not quite boiling, but uh, it's pretty hot, so I feel like I'm gonna, I'm gonna use tongs. I feel like that's the safe way to do this so let's just see let's just see what happens here i'm just gonna I'm just gonna put that put it in put it in there just like just like that and just stir, got some nice soup stew going on here oh uh oh um well i would say that's pretty pretty accurate <laughs> that's pretty accurate to what they said would happen that's incredible i love that that's so cool I don't know why I'm so fascinated by this. I wish I had like five more to do. That was so satisfying. Should I add some, should, 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 I, add some, should I add some pasta to this? You think I should add some pasta to this? Look at that, completely gone. I would give that one tongue up. So let's talk about these shirts in the sense of how they feel, what they're made of, and what makes them kind of unique. One thing I definitely want to point out is the fact that these all have hooks on the back of the neck to make them easy to hang up and easy to dry. Every single one comes with one. It's a really cool addition. I thought maybe at first that they'd be a little scratchy up on the neck and things like that, but you can't even feel if they're there. Also the fact that it's a no tag tag in the sense that it's printed onto the shirt itself makes it absolutely phenomenal in terms of, uh, you know, like how it uh, feels you don't have to worry about tags and all that itchiness in the back and this is actually one of their older shirts I'm wearing right now I, I threw it on so I could show all these shirts at once but these tags on the back are a super nice addition Especially, you know, I like to dry a lot of my clothes Naturally because I don't like to put them in the dryer in case they shrink because I did that with a really nice shirt uh, Once and I'm like, ah, never again So I like being able to hang these up just on the hooks like in my bathroom or in my laundry room It's not really a laundry room. It's like a laundry cabinet, I guess but you know I like being able to just hang these up I hang them all up together even you know, just hang them all up on one hook, boom, let them dry naturally, and bada bing, bada boom, they are super, super comfy. I like that a lot. Okay, so I'm gonna talk about the fabrics pretty briefly on every single one of these. This one is my favorite. I love the way it feels. This is the Traveler, right? And this shirt is made out of, I'm gonna hold it up so you can get a nice view of it while I read what it's made out of. It is made out of a 70% ultra fine merino wool and 30% tinsel, a cooling fiber, right? So awesome materials on these. I'm gonna read a couple other points real quick. I don't have this memorized. I'm not good at that. So I just read them off here. So you can look at my pretty face or I'll put up something to look at instead of me just sitting here reading the materials. But I think it's important because these are really cool. Uh, merino wool and tinsel are two of the best temperature regulating fibers, helping you stay cool in the summer and warm in the winter. It is summer right now and it is blazing hot. And I live in a place where it's dry heat in the 90s and this shirt as well, actually all these shirts, man, are cool. Uh, but these two specifically, which we'll get into all of them as we have done throughout this video already. So another thing about this one is it's going to wrinkle less than a cotton shirt due to the materials and it can absorb up to 30% moisture and still feel kind of like dry to the touch, which is what I was saying. When you go on hikes or walks or you're sweating or maybe even the gym, I used to wear these, well, I used to wear these in the gym or at work when it gets hot as an undershirt and it can absorb all that sweat and still kind of feel dry or keep you cool. That's what you want in a shirt, my man, like, or woman, or woman. Uh, I think that you know, I used to be, and I, I loved the big brands for the gym, you know, Nike, Under Armour, uh, Gymshark, all of those. I used to buy them because I was like, that's the shirt I need because it says so. But like, there's so many other options from other companies that make materials that are honestly way better, almost at the exact same price, sometimes cheaper and sometimes a little bit more expensive. And they're just as functional and just as good. This by far is the most comfortable of the shirts, easy to wear around the house, easy to take on trips. I love it. It is 
absolutely a comfortable shirt on every single level. And like I said, stays dry, keeps you kind of warm to an extent, keeps you cool to a high extent. It's a great shirt for any situation. Absolutely. If you're going to back any of these shirts, that one yeah, is the one I would go with. Okay. So then you get into the trailblazer shirt, right? And this is more of that traditional, traditional, uh, dry fit shirt that you would find. So another thing about all these shirts is this, um, Seaton has told me, uh, in the email I'm reading, cause I asked for like a specific breakdown because I was like, I don't, I don't, I don't know things. So I need people to tell me them, but this is uh, directly getting me on their Kickstarter too. So, uh, at the time, you know, when you watch this, the Kickstarter will be up, you'll be able to read a lot of this on there, but each shirt helps divert five to eight plastic water bottles from entering the ocean and landfills and things like that, helping the environment, helping it be cleaner in a sense. And also it helps with the production, less energy wasted. Also, they are doing a uh, new like finishing thing with algae oil. And that is going to be a phenomenal finish on the shirt. It's already silky smooth. It moves with you. It breathes with you. This is a great shirt for like, outdoor activities, specifically like hiking and running in the gym. You can still use that for this, but this is 100% made for that. And it feels amazing. I took it on a couple hikes. Um, I might have a picture somewhere. I might try to throw up. Um, I've actually used this in a lot of my videos for my, my bags because I go on a lot of hikes when I test my bags because that's the best place to kind of test a lot of these. And I've been wearing this shirt it's popped up in quite a few videos, if I'm being honest with you, because it is phenomenal for outdoor activities. And it is like a silky smooth, it doesn't feel like a dry fit shirt, like that normal, like, like kind of like, I don't know, like rough feeling it just has that nice silky silky feel to it but it acts as a dry knit and i absolutely love that when it comes to this one and then you have this is the day maker right and this one feels like cotton and i thought it was a cotton blend but it's actually a um a recycled polyester and tinsel blend uh so it's quick dry breathable and moisture wicking so it's like a cotton shirt but if a cotton shirt was like better almost you know what i mean so this is like an everyday shirt i like wearing this out if we um go out like grocery shopping or if maybe eventually things open back up we'll use it for uh you know i might i would wear this on a date night this thing is awesome i love this shirt it feels good it looks good i like this one because i like my shirts if i'm going out and i'm doing something that's like a little bit more not like going grocery shopping but if i'm doing something a little bit more like maybe like the movies or like a pub or something like that i want to i like shirts that are a little bit tighter that fit a little bit more form feeling to me than as opposed to a, like a little bit of a looser shirt when i'm like doing outdoors activities and this one fits perfectly it's a medium as i said before i'm 5'8 165 pounds and it fits perfectly like it's just absolutely perfect in every crevice of my body that it fits in that's a weird word i don't like saying it and that will basically do it for uh these three wonderful t-shirts from my good buddies over at seed and i love them i was i was honored to be a part of their first kick well not be a part but get their t-shirts from their first kickstart and the fact that i got these wonderful samples these are all going to come in a wide variety of colors some are going to have like graphic options and things i do believe they're going to have tank tops as well i saw that in like a sneak peek so there's tons of tons and tons of options hopefully they do like a long sleeve variation of uh this one right here because i would absolutely kill to have something like that that might be a stretch goal if you go pledge you never know but i really 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 love all of these shirts i think they're great for a wide 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 variety of different activities i think that if you're looking for a good everyday outdoor athletic t-shirt these are good and they're affordable especially at the kickstarter price and that's why you want to jump on these kickstarters a lot of people are skeptical of kickstarters i've said it in a lot of my videos of bags that are on kickstarter but with seed in their first kickstarter was so smooth their company's been working on this for like over a year everything's been planned down to like the smallest detail when i talk to them they seem to know what they're doing i don't think you're gonna have to worry about anything if you back this it's going to be an incredible project and i'm super super excited to see what they accomplish as they continue to move forward the environmental aspect is obviously one of my favorites I super super love that so if you're looking for a good t-shirt for whatever kind of activity just go and back them that is awesome that's all i have to say about that uh and i guess that's the end of the video so if you have any questions comments or concerns about these t-shirts let me know in the comments below and i'll do my very best to answer those for you if there is a product whether it be a piece of clothing or a bag or a travel product that you want me to get my hands on to do a review on, let me know and I'll do my best to get that and do a review so you know what it's like before you buy it. If you could uh, leave this video a like, subscribe, check, uh, check, check, email me. That's the other one. Email me, odmatthewsbags at gmail.com. 
It's in the YouTube description if you want the exact spelling. Um, let's have a chat. Let's talk about things. If you want more videos or pictures of any of the products that I've done, let me know. If you have, if you want lists of suggestions, let me know. I've got plenty of those I'm willing to share and give you some details about. Um, thank you guys so very, very, very much for uh, watching. And if uh, announcement, when I get to 500 subscribers, I'm doing something really big. So if you want to subscribe and wait for that, or if you want to just come back when I have 500 subscribers, um, you can also come back and do that. But I would suggest you subscribe before 500 because you might get a little bonus in the thing that I'm doing. So I'm really looking forward to that. Um, uh, thank you again for all the support and love that you give me on this channel. It means the world to me. And I will see you guys next time.